Breaking news, folks. We have a tragic incident to report. In Fargo, a shooting took place that resulted in the death of a police officer and injuries to two others. Let's get into the details. Hello, everyone. Today, we bring you unfortunate news from Fargo, where a shooting incident has shaken the community. Here's what we know so far. According to the authorities, the shooting occurred on Friday afternoon, claiming the life of a brave Fargo police officer. The officer has been identified as Jake Wallen, only 23 years old, as confirmed in a news release on Saturday. In addition to the tragic loss of Officer Wallen, two other officers, Andrew Dotas and Tyler Hawes, were critically injured and are currently receiving medical care. Their conditions are reported as critical but stable. During the incident, Officer Zachary Robinson discharged his firearm and shot the suspect, identified as Mohamed Burakate, who was later pronounced dead at a hospital due to his injuries. Sadly, the violence didn't stop there. A 25-year-old woman was also injured during the shooting and has been transported to a healthcare facility for treatment. The authorities have described her injuries as serious. The shooting took place near the intersection of 9th Avenue South and 25th Street South in Fargo, as stated in the official release. This tragic incident has sent shockwaves through the community, and the Fargo Police Department is working diligently to investigate the circumstances surrounding the shooting. Our hearts go out to the families and colleagues of Officer Jake Wallen, as well as the injured officers and the woman harmed in this senseless act of violence. We stand together in solidarity with the Fargo community during this difficult time. We'll continue to follow this story closely and provide updates as they become available. Please stay tuned to our channel for more news and stay safe out there. Thank you for watching, and remember to take care of one another. Goodbye.